welcome to this week's week weekly vlog. Today is Monday and today I'm actually taking my dad out for a very late Father's Day meal. I meant to take him out weeks ago um, but then things kept coming up and it's just been pushed back a bit so I'm taking it out for a nice meal today. Um, we're going to go for lunch. We're going to go to Pesto in the Trafford Centre. Um, so yeah, I think we're going to get there probably around 1 have lunch, maybe look around the shops and then come back. So that's what's happening today. Uh, rest of the week, what have we got planned? Um, I'm going to see Heathers this week. I'm also going to go and see Shrek this week. Lawrence is also going to see Heathers. He's going, I'm going to Mass Nay, he's going to the evening, that's on Wednesday. Um, and then Lawrence is also off on Sunday, so we'll probably do something with the kids on Sunday. So that's what we've got planned for this week. Um, I'm sure I'll do other stuff with the kids as well while they're off. So yeah, that is the plan for the week. So I'm going to go get ready now and uh, head out and I'll probably get back to you now once I am at Pesto. Arrived. I went for garlic bread with cheese, chicken wings, spicy sausage. Chicken fries. Uh, here, here's dad's. Dad is a bit confused about what he ordered. He doesn't think he ordered this, but then he can't remember what he thinks he ordered. He got some chicken fries and some spicy sausage. And yeah, he's not sure he ordered that one, <laughs> but that is what he's got. Because he can't remember what he actually ordered, can you? Yeah. <laughs> And we're going to enjoy our lunch. Hi, so I'm now back from lunch with my dad. I had a really nice time. Um, really enjoyed our meal. Dad got a bit confused with what he'd ordered. Um, some stuff, food came and he said, I'm sure I didn't order that. So he swapped it. And then he, then he saw he had a chicken skewer and he said, I don't think I ordered that either. So I said to him, well, what did you order? And he couldn't remember what he'd actually ordered. So he chuck, stuck with the chicken skewer which he wasn't that keen on. Um, uh, so yeah, next time I need to make more, pay more attention to what he's ordering so he <laughs> gets the right thing. Um, so yeah, I paid for the meal for him because it's his late Father's Day gift because he, he never, I never know what to buy him these days. So we tend to take him out for a meal. So it was nice. We then had a little look around the shops. I think we went in Marks and Spencer's. I went in John Lewis. I've got some John Lewis vouchers that I got for my birthday. So I just wanted to see if there's anything there that I could get. I'll probably get something for like the, um, I'm either gonna buy a circuit machine from John Lewis for my vouchers, or I'm gonna get a silhouette machine and just buy some circuit stuff with my vouchers from John Lewis, or some other craft stuff from John Lewis with my vouchers. Um, I'm not decided yet what I'm gonna do. So we had a look in John Lewis and then uh, we came back, but the meal was really nice. I really enjoyed it. What did I get? I got a beef stew, um, spicy Italian sausage with potatoes and uh, what does it come with? Peppers. And then I got some chicken wings and then some garlic bread with cheese. Uh, my dad, I don't know what my dad ended up with. He ended up with a chicken skewer, that I said. He got chicken thighs and I can't remember what else he got, but I'm sure I might. I think I might have filmed it. But yeah, the meal was really nice. I really enjoyed it. I do like pesto. It's a nice place to go. It's like an Italian restaurant. And it's like little tapas -y bits. So yeah, we went there. And the rest of the day I'm going to do editing. So um, yeah, I'm going to spend the rest of the day doing some editing. And I will probably get back to you tomorrow. Hi, today is Wednesday. It is, I think it's about half 11 now. I'm not quite sure. I'm about to head out into town. I'm going to go get some lunch and take some pyjamas back that I bought for Alice. I don't know if you remember, I bought her some Stitch and Angel ones because she loves Angel. She won't wear them because Stitch is on them. It has to just be Angel. So I need to take them back. I thought she would really like them, but apparently not. So I need to take those back. Um, 
and I'm going to get some lunch and then I'm going to go and see the matinee of Heathers. So I bought this ticket with some of my birthday, but I got some theatre tokens, so I bought this with those. And yeah, because Heathers is like one of my favourite musicals, so I'm really excited to go and see it again. I saw it not long ago in Liverpool, but I really wanted to see it again while it's in Manchester. So I'm going to the matinee and then Lawrence is going to the evening showing tonight. So I'm going to go get ready and then I'm going to head out and I'll probably get back to you now once I'm in town. Okay, so I've just arrived in town. First thing I need to do, go primal and take the pyjamas back that I got for Alice. So that's what I'm gonna do first. Hope it's not massively busy. But usually at this time, the queues are massive, so we'll see. Okay, so it's now quarter to one. Took the pyjamas back, but there's no problem. Just come to get some lunch before the show. It's about quarter to one now, show starts at half two. I've got a bit of time, so I might look around the shops after this. Okay, so I've finished my lunch now. I've got half an hour. I need to go and get to the theatre, so I'm have a quick look around here. So I'm just in Primark now, having a look around. We've got some SpongeBob stuff in at the minute. We've also got Garfield stuff in. Never really been a massive fan of Garfield. And obviously they got lots of Disney stuff. And I know. Oh, it looks like they've got lots of Halloween stuff in Fire Market and all that. Okay, ghost mode. I like this uh, wreath. How much is that? It's eight pounds. Some of backs and twigs. This is a nice little fur. So it's now quarter to two. I'm just walking up to the theatre now. It should take about 10 minutes. It's at the palace today, so it shouldn't take too long to walk up. Okay, so it's five to two now. I'm just walking up to the theatre. I'm a little bit gutted that the uh, marquee still got held in the chocolate factory on and not Heather's. I was hoping to get a nice picture of the uh, theatre. Never mind. Well, so it's like they've got. Jesus I cried superstar Mark Yield as well on the front so we'll see if we've actually got anything Heather's related 
on the front or not, otherwise no point taking a picture of the beta. What can I say? any point going across getting a picture I'm just going to get in a queue okay so I'm in the theatre now and I already have a house programme but we have brochures here I don't think they had a brochure last time at the thing, so I think I'm going to get the brochure. Gonna... Okay, so I've changed mine. I'm not going to bother with merch. Don't need a brochure. I'm just going to go to my seat. Yeah, this is the queue. It's actually worse than it was in Liverpool and I thought Liverpool's queue was bad. So yeah, not going to bother with merch today. But I'll see if I can uh, quickly show you what they have got. And I might get a brochure in the interval when it's a bit quieter. Okay, so I'm in stores. I'm just gonna go down. I've just got this to take pictures with. I can get a brochure in the interval. Decide I want one. I'm not queuing up in that queue, it's ridiculous. So yeah, I'm on. So I'm on P3 today. It should be a side for you. I'm on the side. Oh, yeah just next to this pond. Okay, so my seat is just behind this pond. So I'm just gonna go down to the front and have a quick look in the uh, orchestral pit. I love looking in the orchestral pit. See what we've got down here. from my seat. They're yeah, quite a good view, so I'll get back to you now in the interval. So it is now the interval. The show is excellent as usual. I managed to get a brochure in the interval. Um, so yeah, really good. Looking forward to the second half now and I'll get back to you at the end of the show.
so the show is over now it was excellent as usual but i have to rush home now because lawrence is coming to the evening showing so i need to get home so he can come and see it so i'll get back to you when i'm home Thursday. It's actually just coming up to five o'clock now. Um, I spent most of today doing a bit of editing, playing with the tr with Leo's train track with Leo, and yeah, that's all I've really done today. So I've not filmed anything. But I am after dinner going to head out to the theatre. I'm going to go and see Shrek the Musical, which I'm quite excited about. The last time I saw Shrek the Musical, I think it was like 2014, 2013, something like that. I remember me and Lawrence went one Christmas. And I can't remember if it was the Christmas that we met or the Christmas after. So it's either 2013 or 2014 that we went to see Shrek the Musical. So it would be interesting to go and see it. Um, I'm going by myself because Lawrence is at work today. My parents are going to watch the kids. So yeah, it should be a nice evening. It's very, very warm today. So I hope the air comes good in the theatre because it's very, very warm. And yeah, so I'll probably get back to you now once I'm heading out. Okay, so I've just arrived at the tram station. The tram's not due for another eight minutes. I should still get to the theatre in plenty of time. It's only a small one though, so I'm going to sit down and wait for it to come. Okay, so I've just got off the tram now at St. Peter's Square. I'm just going to walk up to the Opera House. It should take about 10 minutes, so I'll get back to you now once I'm at the fit. I'm going to go and try and take a picture in a minute and there's a bit of space on this road so we'll put down so I get a picture before I head in
Okay, so I'm just in the queue for the merch. I'm just gonna get a program and the magnet, the usual. But they've got lots of stuff. Got some t-shirts. So I'm now in the theatre, I just bought myself a program. I'm just gonna head to my seat now. I'm in the stalls today. One row X, seat six. So I'm gonna head down now. Middle, but I'm just going to take some pictures first before I go and sit down. Okay, so now in my seat, I'm on row X, seat three. The show's going to start in about 10 minutes. So I'll quickly show you the view from my seat. And I did check, and you can film the curtain call, so I'll try and film that for you later. So yeah, to show you the view. Okay, so this is the view from my seat. Okay, so I'll get back to you now in the interval. Hi, so it is now the interval and I'm really enjoying it so far. They are aligning quite a lot on screens rather than props. I'm not sure how I feel about that, but yeah, it's really good. Um, I'll get back to you at the end of the show. finished now it was it was really good
hi today is saturday i'm sorry i've not got back to you since thursday i think it was when i went to the theater but yesterday i just was playing with the children playing train tracks so there wasn't really much to film yes alice they're patiently waiting because they want to make some what we're we making alice cupcakes. chocolate cupcakes alice's favorite so we're gonna make some chocolate cupcakes well it's not for your birthday just for now aren't they but when it's your birthday we'll make some more mm. yeah so yeah we're gonna make some chocolate cupcakes yeah, and then we were gonna make some rice krispie treats but i'm not sure we've got enough butter so we might have to do them another I day want that butter. yeah that butter so we're gonna make a start on making these i had a nice relaxing bath this morning yeah. i used my bath bomb that i got for my birthday i've been waiting to use that for ages make so yes we're gonna do it now so right we're gonna get started now because alice is waiting and i'll get back to you later okay so first we need to measure out the stuff don't we alice yeah, yeah. so what do we need first do we need the butter i don't do it both you want to do the butter so we only need 40 grams of butter so we don't need a lot so let's get a bowl okay. put that to zero on zero. Which way is it going? Wrong way. Zero. That's right, Leo. That's zero, isn't it? There we go. Not big and then we need zero. it. We only need it to go to the second line. So we only need a really tiny bit, Alice. Zero. I'm fine. Yeah. Put that yeah. in. See if that's enough. Not in that one. In that one. That's it. A bit more. Yeah. Let Leo do a little bit now. You yeah, have a little go, Leo. Alice, let Leo have a little go. Let go of the spoon. Mommy. There's a tiny bit, Leo. That's it. There we go. And then when we put a little bit more in, and then that should be enough. My, my turn See? now. Do a little bit. That's it. That's all we need. We don't need a lot of butter for this one. Okay. Okay, so that's our butter. So we'll put that there. Put the butter away. Put it in there. Oh, Lee, that Mickey ball. Yeah. That's mine. That was Leo. Okay, so now we need 100 grams of this flour. So Alice can have a little go, then Leo can have a little go. Do you want to get, shall I get you a spoon? Cut it. Get you a spoon. Not all. Okay. There's a spoon. So you get, lift it out with a spoon and you put it into there for no, the moment. I'll do it. Big one. We'll cut it. Um, you find it? No. I'll help you. Oh. It's all at the bottom of it. Flip it open a little bit. There you go. Can you see it now? There it is. Put it in here. That's it and put it in there. Good girl. Want some more? Yep. Yeah. Cut it. Uh, you do one more spoon and then Leah do a spoon. Hey. That's it. Good girl. Uh oh. Right, Leah's turn. Let go now. Leah's go. There you go, Leah. We need to get it to that big line there. Okay. Put it into the sieve. Might want to stand up, Leo, if it's easier to reach. You can reach it. Yeah, stand up then if you can't reach it. Don't spill it. That's it. A little bit more, that's it. Put it in. Right, let's see. It needs to get, does it get to the big line on here? Not there. Tiny bit more then. Is it there? Is that the big line? Yeah, you did it. Okay, so we've got that. Then we need 20 grams of this chocolate powder. Me. I do it. Alright, so can you uh, can Alice have the spoon, Leah? Where's the spoon? Yeah. There we go. Okay, so 
so just a tiny bit with that one. Chocolate, can you reach? I'll help chocolate. you. Chocolate. There we go. Shake that one. Chocolate and die. Um, chocolate. 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 I think that's all we need. We've got a tiny bit. Chocolate. Let me just check it. That's enough, I think. That's chocolate. Yep, that's enough. Oh, look, you can put a tiny, only a teeny, teeny, weeny bit, Leo. Teeny, teeny, weeny bit. I'll help you. Ghetto. You've had a go. Oh, I'll do a ghetto. That's a bit too much, Leah. Let's just put half of it in. That's enough. Chocolate. 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 There we go. That's enough now. Oh, yeah, it makes a chocolate cake, doesn't it? Oh, Daddy. Yeah. Did. Mm. Okay, so that's all done. Now, we just need 100 mils of milk. Milk. Yeah, 100 mils there. So, I'm going to show Leo where we need to put the milk. One, two, three, milk. Three milk. So, Leo, see there? Where it says 100. We need to get the milk to that line there. That line. Yeah, so you tell Mummy when we get to that line, okay? Can you tell me when it's at the line? Oh, that line? Is it there yet? Red. Not yet. Oh. Is it at the line? Red. Yeah, good boy. Thank you. Um, okay, Mummy will do the egg. in here okay then we're gonna put it in there ready you help me pour a little bit in that's it then can you put that into the milk just with a pig spoon and then egg let's tip it in alice in. good girl oh, lemon. now we've got to mix that now. lemon oh, lemon right oh. so we've got to mix the egg the milk and the vanilla all together in here. Mix, 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 mix. 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 It's going to make chocolate, yeah. Okay, so now we're going to go over to Mummy's mixer and we're going to mix that little bit of butter with our flour. Okay. I'll make chocolate. Do you want Mummy to do it and then bring it back? Yeah? Or do you want to come to the mixer and have a look? Is it too loud? Okay, Alice will stay here. Do you want to come to the mixer, Leo? Yeah. Okay, Leo's going to come to the mixer. Okay, so me and Leo have come to the mixer. It's too loud for Alice, so Alice is going to stay at the table, aren't you, Alice? Well, me and Leo do the mixing. So, I'm going to put a little bit of butter to get our spoon in here, Leo. Butter in. Get it all out. Put it in there, don't we? And then, Leah, we're going to add our flour. Is that a mango? So, this is our flour. Oh, all our different flour, baking powder, and salt is in that mixture. Right, we're going to pour this in here. Do you want to help me? Let me just move you a bit up here. There we go, Leah's going to help me. I yeah. did! One second. <laughs> there you are. Here's Leo. Right, you hold it with mummy. We're going to pour it in, ready? Pour, pour, pour. Pour, pour, pour. Pour, pour, Is it all in, Leo? All in. Yeah, it's all in. All in. Okay, so now we're going to put this down, aren't we, Leo? And then we're going to put the mix on. It's going to get loud now, Alice, okay? 
So Alice knows it's getting loud, so she knows. There we go. And mix that in, are There's not a lot of butter in there, so it won't mix very well. But mix it a little bit, so it's all mixed. That's what it's like when we mix our butter in. It's only 40 grams of butter, so it wasn't mixed great. So now we're going to add our half of our milk mixture and mix it. Yeah, now we're going to pour some of this in, okay? Let's mix this. Do you want to give it a little mix? Okay. You mix that. Mix, mix, mix. Mix, mix, mix. Good work, Leah. Well done. Okay, so we're going to pour a little bit of this into the... Oh, can you hold it there? Right, and then pour a bit in. Only a little, I'll tell you when to stop. Come on, pour it in. And a bit more stop. Stop. Good boy, we we'll do that bit later. Let go of it now. It's live. I'll we'll put that bit in in a minute. Literally. Okay. Okay, so Leo's poured some of our milk mixture in. Whoa. Now we're going to mix it and then we're going to add the rest, are we, Leo? Yeah. So we're going to mix it now. Ready? Do you want to turn it that way? Sit. Let's lift it up. Wow, chocolate. Yeah. Yummy. Yummy. Yummy chocolate. Yeah, it still needs a bit more milk added, doesn't it? Very fit. Oh yeah, it needs some, it needs the rest of that milk mixture pouring in there. More milk. Yeah. Okay, so this is what it looks like when we've mm. mixed half the milk mixture. Now Leo's going to pour the rest in. You can pour it in, Leo. Mm. Leo's going to pour it in. That's it into there, Leo. Mm. Pour all of it in now. Put it in now. Go on. All in. Ooh, wow, wow. That's it. All of it in there. Wow, wow. Yeah, put some more in. It's not all in yet. All of it. Is it all in? All in. Good boy. Go. In a circle's it gone? Right. Okay, there we go. Dad, so now, are you going to do the button for me again? Yeah. Put the button. Six, six, six. Okay, so this is what it looks like when you've added the rest of the milk mixture. It does look quite sloppy, but I remember it looking like this last time, but it actually made really nice cakes. So hopefully this is okay. So we're gonna, we're just gonna give it a quick little mix with a spoon, and then we're gonna add it to the cake cases. That's chocolate. That's chocolate. Yeah. Mix. Right, should we take it over here and we can put it in the cake cases? Okay, Alice. Okay, so we're now going to put the chocolate mixture into the cases. It's quite sloppy. We might make a bit of a mess, but Alice is going to do the first ones and then Alice is, Leo's going to do the second ones. Where's your spoon, Alice? Um, is this one yours? Yeah. That's yours. Okay. So I'm going to help you because it's quite sloppy, isn't it? It's very sloppy. Oh, that's cute. I hope it's going to work. Right, get to this weight and fixed it. Oh, right, that's one. Right, it's very, very sloppy. Okay. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be this sloppy. Oh. Oh. Well, hopefully it'll work. We'll have to see. It's very. Mummy might have to do this because it is very runny. Why not? Yeah, it's very runny, isn't it? Runny. Yeah. Right, Mummy's gonna do this bit, Leah, because it's a bit too runny for you to do. Mummy, yeah, man. it's too runny. It's too wow. much. That's too much. Yeah, put too much in that one. Oh, too much. Too much, too much. Ooh. Mm. <laughs> right, 
Don't be disappointed if this doesn't work. <laughs> this is quite runny, isn't it? Oh, really? drop in each Cakes are gonna work. Aww. Yeah, because we forgot the baking powder. Baking powder. And that's what makes it rise. <laughs> we'll put it on now. Oh, wow. Now. A little bowl. Right, now I need to mix it each one with the baking powder in it. Bowl. I'm not holding my breath that these are gonna work a now. Little bowl. In a minute, Alice. Chocolate. Just got to mix the baking powder in. See what happens. I'm not holding my breath. Uh, let's put them in. Okay. Okay. Leo really wants to make rice crispy treats, so we're gonna see if we've got enough stuff to do it. I've right, got just enough for butter, Leo. Okay. 250 grams of rice krispies, Leo. Okay. So, see I this, Leo? See Look at the line. Why? Right, just put that on naught. You tell me if it's on naught, that line. Oh, no. It's on naught. So, you need to get it just past that big That's bit where it says 200. Yeah. 200. So halfway, about. 200. That's right, Leo. Yeah. No, it'll beep when it's finished, Two, shall it? 200. It's on 200. Yeah, we just need a little bit more past 200. We need 250. 250. 20. 40, 250, there we go, here we are, me and Leo are now going to cut up marshmallow. our marshmallows, we need 300 grams of marshmallows, don't we, so that bowl is set to zero, so we can add it to this, okay. I think the whole bag all we've got left should be enough of what we need, Leah. We should need all of these marshmallows. One, Yeah. I think the whole bag is free. Oh, leg is done. We're going to cut them up small so that they'll melt easier. Okay, so we melted the marshmallows and the butter. Although it wasn't butter, it was margarine. So I'm not sure if this is going to work either. We're not having much luck today with our baking. Um, because it went a bit funny looking with the margarine not like it usually looks it's just it's a nice white sticky this just went to like a really yellowy not very sticky so we'll see because usually it's like really like stretchy and looks like spider webs whereas this just poured in not sticky at all so maybe it doesn't work with margarine we could have just wasted everything so we'll see I'm, I'm not holding my breath actually that this is going to work either so i'm going to put this into the tray and see what happens okay so our cakes have come out they didn't work they are like the little pancakes and i don't know how well they're going to taste because this has got a big blob of baking powder there so we'll see if they like them <laughs> okay we're going to put them on the cooling rack to cool and then you can have one okay Hi, today is Sunday. It is just coming up to one o'clock. We are about to go out to Asda. 
Um, we're not sure if we're going to have to get a tram because we just looked and I think the buses are on strike. So I'm not sure if there's going to be any buses. So we might have to um, get a tram. And my face looks horrendous. I put some cream on it and it's made it super, super red. So yeah, it looks a bit of a mess today. But anyway, we're going to head out now and uh, find out whether we're going to get a bus or a tram. So we've come to the tram stop because I don't think there's any buses. Lauren's just getting our ticket. Should I see Daddy getting our ticket? Hi, Mum. Getting our ticket. Hello. Yep. Family at the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. Two, two three. three. Four, four, three. That's what. Yeah. Two, three, one, no family. No, did We've arrived at the Trafford Centre. Lauren's just gone to get us our lunch because it's two o'clock now, so we're all quite hungry. And obviously the shops, well, as the show's closes at half four, so we need to uh, have lunch then quickly go to Asda to get their uniform up at their new uniforms today. Alice really wants to do the roller skating, but we've just not got time today. Next time we'll try it, aren't we? We're going to do it next time we come, me and you. Yeah, me and Alice are going to do it next time, aren't we? The roller skating. What, darling? Okay. Daddy's got off. Okay, so we've finished with lunch now, so we're coming in here to look for Alice's pink bath thing. Look at that pink car bath bomb, Alice. You like that car one? Yeah. Oh, you get that one. You want to get that one? Have a look. Oh, I'll be back. That one. Bubble bar. Cherry scented bubbles. Mm. Oh, this is the one Alice likes. Should we get that one? So we've all got, what's that for daddy? We've all got some, haven't we? Save some money. <laughs> there you go, Leo. Okay, so we've just come across to Alistair now because we need to get this little boy his school uniform. That's what we've come to look for. Wait for mummy, Leo. Like, where are you two going? What are you doing? So we're just back from Asda. I got Leo this dinosaur water backpack. Where's yours? Alice got a unicorn one. Go and get it so I can open it. And this is Alice's unicorn one. It shows you a unicorn. It's a lovely pink unicorn. And it's got a water gun. That yeah. was done. Yeah, so we'll open them, aren't we? And they've got the little backpack. Can you show me your unicorn? Turn around, let me see. Dan, couldn't we, when Dan comes? Mummy, water talk. <laughs> and one out. One out. No, you should have lots of water, Leo. Try again. Might just have to pump it a bit. Pump, pump, pump. There you go. Just need pumping. 
No, not now. Not in the house. Wait till Daddy comes out. You've got to do it over there. Alice, you've got to do it on the grass. I did it. You did, clever boy. It far. It does go far. Are <laughs> you aiming at Daddy? Mm -hmm. You can get me. Ah! Catch him. Quick, get him. Leo, <laughs> you got points at him. <laughs> Quick, get Daddy. <laughs> She's coming, Daddy. Quick, Leo, get Daddy. <laughs> get him, Leo. later for I better finish this week's weekly vlog before I head to bed everyone else is in bed um we had a nice little day at the shops we managed to get Leo his new school uniform so I can't wait to try it on him and see what he looks like but it's gonna look so cute in his uniform and he was really excited about getting it so maybe tomorrow I might try it on him um uh, what else would we get Alice well Leo we went to look at some books because Leo really wanted um some of the Julia Donnesson and Axel Schiffler books I think there's two that he hasn't got. He wanted um, Charlie Cook's something, is it new book? I'm not sure what it's called. That one and then the baddies, he wanted those two but they didn't have them in. They never seem to have those two in when we go. So I think I might have to order them off Amazon for him or something. But he really wanted those two and he didn't have them so he decided he didn't want any books. So there's an offer on in as you get two for seven pounds or the four pounds each or something like that. So I said Alice could, could get two and she wanted two bluey books. So she got two bluey books and he didn't get any books because he just he didn't want any if they didn't have those ones. And so she got those. Obviously got them them water backpack, water gun backpack things, which she had a great time playing with in the garden. And they were really good. They were only £3.20 each. I think they should have been £10 to reduce £3.20. So they were a bargain. The kids absolutely loved them. So I got soaked. Actually soaked me and Lawrence with them, but they had a lot of fun. So they were definitely a good buy. Um what else did we get from Asda? I think that's all we got from Asda. The books, the water guns and the uniform. That's what we got from Asda. And then from Lush, Leo got a bubble bar, blue bubble bar. Alice got a pink bubble bar. And I got two bath bombs with my birthday money. I think I got the Barbie one. Alice really wanted me to get the pink Barbie one. So I got that because she really wanted me to get that one. I think that was £6. And I think I got the intergalactic one as well. Um, that was £6. We got those. And that's everything that we bought from the shops. I think all together it came to about £70. So it was a lot of money. But that was because we got the school uniform and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's what we got from the shop today. So I hope you've enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. I absolutely have no idea what we actually filmed this week or what we did. I know I went to the theatre twice. I went to see... Heathers and Shrek. I saw Heathers on Wednesday, I saw Shrek on Thursday. Um, I went out for a meal with my dad, his late Father's Day meal on the Monday. Uh, did some baking, some very terrible baking that all went wrong with the kids. Was it yesterday? Saturday? I think we did the baking. That yeah, was the worst baking I've ever done. So yeah, that all went wrong. Even the Rice Krispie treats didn't go to plan. Uh, but Alice has enjoyed eating them, so. At least they got eaten where the cupcakes had to be binned because they were inedible. I've never baked anything that's been inedible before. <laughs> but they were inedible. So we'll have to do some more baking another day. Um, we'll buy some more flour because we've got no flour left. So that's been our week. Oh, that's been our week this week. So hopefully you've enjoyed this week's weekly vlog. Next week, what have we got planned for next week? I don't think we've got much planned for next week yet. I think I'm going to go and see one musical next week. Um, originally I had my name down for the press night and then they decided that they weren't doing a press night uh, for the show while it's at the Lowry because I think it's only on for three days at the Lowry so it, uh, it didn't really seem much point to do a press night because by the time you've seen it on the day and you wouldn't, probably wouldn't get it up till 
the next day it's only on then for another day so I understand why they're probably not doing a press night um so i bought a ticket anyway it's for la bamba a new musical uh there's an offer on at manchester theatres for i think it's a 20 pound best available ticket so luckily i managed to get a ticket um for that there wasn't very many tickets left to be honest on the days that i could go so i did manage to get a stall seat but it is quite far back um but i sat there before for the shows and the view's really good so i'm quite happy from where, where it is um, and only paid like £20 for the ticket. Well, it's £20 plus booking fee. So I think it worked out about £23. Um, but still, still a good price. So hopefully it's good. Um, like I said, it's a new musical, so I've not seen it before. So that's what we've got planned for next week. We'll probably do something with the kids as well. I think Lawrence and I are going to meet up with our friends on Thursday. Maybe go bowling or go for a meal or something. Because that's the day we're supposed to be going to the press night. Um, and obviously it's been cancelled so uh, Lauren swapped his shift so that he'd be off uh, because he very rarely gets to come to press night so he made sure he swapped his shift so he could come and then it got cancelled so we're going to do something we're, me and Lawrence are going to go out since we've got the babysitter so I think we're going to go either bowling or go for a meal or something hopefully with some of our friends so that is the plan for next week so yeah like I said I hope you've enjoyed this week's weekly vlog if you have please do give it a like don't forget to subscribe and I hope to see you again soon bye